Welcome to the Goal Zero Toolbox Talk Series. Today's Toolbox Talk. Extension Cord Safety. Electrical outlets aren't always available in the exact location where they are needed. When the need for electricity is temporary, extension cords can be a quick way to supply the necessary power to get a job done. Extension cords must not be used in place of permanent wiring, and they must be used correctly to maintain safety. Damaged or improper use of electrical and extension cords is consistently one of the most common safety concerns identified by hands during annual surveys. Electrical shock can cause significant injury or death and fires resulting in substantial damage. Cords should not be used if The insulation is damaged or cracked. Wires are visible. The ground prong is missing. Either end is cracked or melted. Either end is visible burn marks. In standing water, a triple cord adapter is used. Equipment pulls a heavy load, microwave, fridge, toaster, etc. For more than three consecutive days. If damaged cords are found, discontinue use immediately and take the cord or tool out of service. Report damage to your supervisor. Have the cord repaired following UL standards or render the cord unusable and discard it. Tips to extend cord life. Keep extension cords hung up or put away out of direct sunlight. Plug and unplug the cord by gripping the end instead of pulling on the cord. Do not wrap power cords tightly around a tool to prevent sharp bends or breaks where the cord meets the tool. Inspect cords before each use. Buy only cords approved by an independent testing laboratory, such as Underwriters Laboratories, UL, Intertech, ETL, or Canadian Standards Association, CSA. Extension Cord Designations S. Designed for general use W. Rated for outdoor use J. Standard 300 voltage insulation T. Made from vinyl thermoplastic P. Parallel wire construction, air conditioner cords and household extension cords. O. Oil resistant. E. Made from TPE.